Well, when the weather is yucky like this, nothing beats a big bowl of comfort food. Let's be honest, even if the sun is shining, nothing beats a big, big bowl, bowl of, of comfort, comfort food. food. Yeah, well, that's exactly what we are making today. Owner and chef from Adam's Ribs in Fruitland, Pete Roscovich, is here to show us how to make lobster mac and cheese with a side of asparagus. This sounds good already. Yeah. So what is it we need? What is it we're going to be putting in this? So Pork. we're going to start with like a pan, but we have a garlic one with a little more flavor. Okay, so we're what goes in? Spray that down. Tell, tell me the ingredients. We're going to need the ingredients for the mac and cheese. What do we got in there? So the mac and cheese, we're going to start with heavy cream. Uh -huh. That's okay. going to be first. And then uh, we're going to start... Macaroni? Cilantro? Macaroni, cilantro, green onions, um, some fresh lobster, Romano cheese, and a little bit of shredded cheese. Okay. Ah. Okay, All right, go. so you're going to have me get started on that? Correct. So first we're going to start with the heavy cream. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't take a lot of cream, about two tablespoons. Okay. And now we're going to take that and we're going to add some um, macaroni to it. All right, you're doing all the work here. Well, you're going to do something. I'm going to give you a chance. See, now I know why okay. you're standing on that end of the table. We need to get Jimmy to work over here, too. <laughs> so we're just going to move that around the pan a little bit. Okay, well, yeah, you should do that because I'm yeah, very bad at oh, that. Oh, you could do that. Okay. You could do that left handed. All right, so now we're going to add some cheese. Okay, all of the, what's in here? About half of that, Romano about cheese. Half of that. Okay. That's good. And the, white, the yellow cheese. About half of that. Yeah, that's Oops, good. Try not to get it on that's the burner. Like a little I bit of white did. wine. It's fun to cook with white wine. Okay. Sometimes it even goes in the recipe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we can add um, a little bit of the cilantro and green onions. Okay. This really goes together quick. It is very fast. And then some green onion. And some green onion. And then you can put the lobster in. Lobster. Okay. Uh -huh. Do you pick a particular uh -huh. kind of lobster? It's a, I just went and bought that at Giant yesterday. It's a five ounce portion right there. I bought a whole lobster, steamed it, and picked mm -hmm. it. So it's real easy to do at home. It's just no fancy ingredients. You can buy the pasta, and then we're just gonna let that sit for a minute. Okay, I'll that's keep an eye on it. That's it. You get him started on the uh, Let's asparagus. Let's do the asparagus. What so am I doing? Go here? ahead and chop the uh, asparagus, the you, tips. You sprayed me down here, so I'm taking yep, the, that's perfect. the tips. Yep. Okay. And look, no fingers. All right. So while we're while we're doing this, tell me what else is going in this beside the asparagus. Um, we're gonna use some uh, cherry tomatoes. Okay. And some red onions. All right. And then a spice of your choice. A spice I just did of like, my choice. I just did a Montreal steak seasoning. Oh, you get to choose. I would choose. The spice of your choice. Or you can blend this stuff. And this is just basically salt, pepper, garlic. So just over the top? Mm hmm But let's put the onions down oh, first. Oh, onions first. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm, I'm getting a little ahead of myself. Here. He's That's excited. I'm, I'm loving the asparagus thing. My wife is going to say, okay, you're going to make it's that so when you get home, It's so easy. You don't right? have to blanch it. You just raw asparagus, put it in the oven. It's done in like five to ten minutes. Really? Wow. Yeah, I put the oven that? on the 450, so it's a little hotter, a little faster. I like onions. And put it in a broiler as well. I like onions. Is that okay? That's fine. Okay, good. Onions. Okay, then just put your cherry tomatoes on. All right. Just kind of spread them around. Spread them around. And this is healthy too. I mean, we've got asparagus, we've yeah. got tomatoes. Well, yeah, it's a great summer dish. Yeah. And then we can finish it with a little olive oil. Ah. Not okay. so much the the macaroni and cheese, maybe not. I don't so we'll just go like this with the olive oil. Just like so. Across. All right. And then throw them in the oven. And we're done. Well, that's okay. it. Okay. Now that's while it. you're doing that, you're okay. saying that we could actually put this in a pan and put it in the oven, right? Correct. If we wanted to do that, we could put it in the oven and bake it off with a little uh, breadcrumbs uh -huh. and a little more cheese. But we're going to go ahead so it's and ready put right it now. in a pan here and taste it. Your fork's right there to the left. Oh, you already got a forks and everything. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, Jimmy, Look, this oh, is going to be ready? a little nice. hot. It's very fast. Here. I think really was it. It took what, like just a couple of minutes. Couple to do. minutes. It's very simple. You'll notice that That's I made it. sure that I got a piece of lobster this time. I think you got all the lobster last yeah. time. Yeah, well, I got all lobster this time too. <laughs> Did you really? <laughs> mm. Huh? I can taste the wine. That is so a good. A little bit of wine it adds adds to it. Especially mm. the, and last night I put a little lemon juice in the in the lobster already oh and let goodness. that sit for a day. Okay. That so really spices. That really adds to it. Thank you. So the fresh have, cilantro is wonderful. Nice. We have the asparagus in the oven. Correct. We're gonna mm -hmm. taste that. So we don't want you to go anywhere okay. just quite yet because up next he's gonna share with us another mac and cheese recipe. But this one is for those who may not be big on seafood. We're gonna give you one hint. Bacon. Oh. The Marble Life will be right back. I'll just take this. One. <laughs> no, 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 okay. no, no. Yeah. Oh. 